Hey, uh, my name is Hayden Hensley. I am the youth pastor here at this Canyon campus. Um, and I wanted to share a little bit of my story of healing uh, with you, the church. When I was in eighth grade, um, I had some troubles with my back. Uh, I used to run the hurdles and track. and uh, But as I was running the hurdles one day, I stepped pretty wrong on my foot and I felt this shooting pain kind of go up uh, my back on the right side. So I went to the doctor and uh, various doctors, many doctors to see, you know, if they could fix it. Um, and eventually I was entered into physical therapy. It was a huge bummer because I had these plans to compete in athletics. Um, and I had some summer plans too that I really wanted to take advantage of, but my back was, was hurt. My back was injured. I couldn't, I couldn't do a whole lot with it. Fast forward into the summer. Uh, I had the privilege to go to Cedar Canyon for church camp. When I got into worship, the atmosphere, it, it felt different, but it was nothing that I could participate in because of the pain that I had in my back. Uh, I definitely couldn't lift my hands like past my chest, probably. I was in so much pain, and so all I did was sit in the back pew the whole time as worship was going, as the speaker was going. Uh, I just sat in the back pew. I remember during the first few songs of worship, my small group leader, uh, he came up to me and he said that there's some people in the back that have the spiritual gift of healing and they want to pray for you. And, and coming up to, I guess, the leader of this prayer ministry, this healing ministry that they had at a camp made up of, of some of the leaders that were at camp. And his eyes were so excited and he had the biggest smile on his face. It was like he knew that, that God was going to move, that God had already moved in that place. He, uh, he started praying. He said, lay down on your stomach. We're going to pray for your back. And I mean, just, just laying down took so much out of me. And all of a sudden, more and more hands just started coming across my back. And it was my friends that were out there at camp laying their hands on my back and praying for me. And eventually all of these hands, what I felt was the sensation that I can't describe only as if all of these hands really turned into one giant hand laid across my back. And it took maybe five minutes and they finished the prayer. I stood up and immediately tears were, were coming out of my eyes. I, I can't explain, you know, thinking about crying, but I was just crying and I was so joyful, so happy because in that moment there was zero pain. And I, I've never been the same since. That next night, uh, June 25th of 2012, I would give my heart uh, to the Lord. I would, I would rededicate my life to the Lord and I've never looked back since. The next year I was called into ministry. That's where I got in the, in the same tabernacle, in the same place. I was called into ministry. Um, and, and my life has never been the same.